ALF TV series. While most of the science fiction of ALF was played for comedic value, there were a few references to actual topics in space exploration, for example, ALF uses a radio signal as a beacon in the pilot episode. Episodes dealt with ALF learning about Earth and making new friends both within and outside of the Tanner family, including Willie's brother Neil, Kate's widowed mother Dorothy with whom ALF has a love-hate relationship, her boyfriend Wizza, the Arkman X nephew Jake, a psychologist named Larry and a blind woman named Jody who never figures out that ALF is not human. Principal puppeteer Paul Fusco used his left hand to control ALF's mouth, while his right hand controlled ALF's right arm. To avoid wear and tear on the principal ALF puppet, the performers rehearsed with a crude early version of ALF, nicknamed Ralph IV. After ALF's cameo alongside former Family Ties star Michael Gross, ALF disappeared through a hole in the riser, was stuffed into a case, and immediately removed from the building. ABC resolved the cliffhanger on 17 February, 1996, with the TV movie project, ALF. NBC executive Brandon Tartikoff later told Fusco that the network regretted cancelling ALF prematurely, saying it was a big mistake that we cancelled your show, because you guys had at least one or two more seasons left. In the pilot episode L.F., ALF is seen consuming a beer with Brian. Select episodes of both shows are included as special features on the ALF, Season 2 DVD as well as the cartoon-specific releases ALF Animated Adventures, 20,000 Years in Driving School and Other Stories and ALF and the Beanstalk and Other Classic Fairy Tales. ALF's hit talk show in 2004, ALF's hit talk show debuted on US cable channel TV Land, which featured ALF as a Johnny Carson-type TV talk show host and co-starring Ed McMahon as his sidekick, F624B96C2C4, 